It's definitely not an ordinary mass. Up in the front pews, men and women wear robes and old-fashioned white wigs. It may not be that common, but the so-called Red Mass has a very specific purpose. The judges and the barristers appear in their robes uh, and they ask for guidance of the Holy Spirit in the administration of justice in the year ahead. The Australian Bar Association held its conference in Rome and to mark the occasion, the country's embassy to the Holy See organized the Red Mass in the Basilica of San Lorenzo. It's believed to be the first Red Mass held in Rome but the practice itself first started in France and England about 600 years ago. When there was a mass involving a lot of judges, everybody was wearing what I'm wearing now, and so it was got its name from that, the Red Mass, simply from the colour of the gowns. With time, other countries with English law traditions adopted it. Its practice was left behind in some areas, but in the 20th century, the tradition was revived by some prominent legal centers. Safeguards the common good. And to highlight the importance of law, the Mass was celebrated by American Cardinal Raymond Burke, who serves as the president of the Vatican Supreme Tribunal. His homily was very interesting. He touched upon a number of very important and controversial topics. And so, with this Red Mass, the start of Australia's legal year was marked in Rome. And just like it was done back in the 12th and 13th centuries, it was attended by judges, lawyers, teachers, and students, all asking for the grace and guidance of the Holy Spirit as they fulfill the responsibility of implementing justice.